In today's video, we're going to go through uh, an introduction to Lifter LMS sidebars in the Astra theme. So uh, as you can see here, I'm in my WP admin dashboard, and I also have the customizer in Astra open in a new tab. If you don't know how to get here, you can pretty easily head there by heading over to Appearance and Customize if you're on the back end here. Otherwise, if you're on the front end, there should be an option to click on Customize uh, right here in the top. But let's head back over here to show you an example of what I'm talking about. So if I head into a course, I'll show you what I'm talking about with the sidebars. Uh, I'll view this course. I have uh, the Lifter LMS Quizzes course here, and you can see there's no sidebar. Um, the sidebars can be useful if you want to have something in a lesson that uh, is maybe a syllabus, so students can jump around from lesson to lesson or just see where they're at generally. Uh, and in order to add a sidebar in the Astro theme in Lifter LMS, what we'll want to do is head to the customizer, head to layout, sidebar, and then we can see all of our options here. Uh, and then down here we have the Lifter LMS options for Lifter LMS general, things like memberships, uh, and then courses and lessons as well. So this is the one we're going to want to use. So we can have a left sidebar or a right sidebar. I'll go with the right sidebar for this example, and we can also set the sidebar width if you'd like to do that as well. So I'll publish my changes here, and we'll reload this lesson, and we should have space for a sidebar here. And we can see I have the course progress and then the section is being displayed. Um, so where can we edit this information? Uh, in order to do that, we'll want to head back to our WP admin area and we'll want to make sure we are in appearance and widgets. And this is where we can put widgets in and we are looking at the lesson sidebar there. We can see we have course progress and I have a, a short code in here uh, and I'll go over the short code in another video, but uh, we can put any of these widgets into that sidebar. So. Uh, we can see I have a calendar option, categories, and all sorts of things to play around with. So what I can do is actually pull in the course syllabus as an example, and we can give it a title. This is my title, and I'll just delete this one for now as an example. And I'll want to make sure I save my widgets here, and then if I head over to my quiz course, we should see now I have the full syllabus that's being displayed by that that widget there and we can rearrange the order of these or uh, add anything in here if I wanted to add a gallery meta or maybe I have a link to a blog post I want to promote or like a latest blog post kind of thing uh, you can have that in there pretty easily as well and each widget has its own options with uh, like this one has a collapsible outline if you'd like uh, to use that but each widget's a little bit different and you can use something like Elementor or page builder to build a two column layout and functionally create a sidebar you won't technically be using the sidebar settings, but if you'd like to use like templates or something to create that, you could do that as well. And I'll go into that in a future video. But that about wraps it up for using widgets in sidebars in Lifter LMS in the Astra theme. This has been Will Middleton from WPCourseGuide.com. Uh, thanks for joining me, and I'll see you in the next video.